Okay, now you're going to feel some pressure. You let me know if you feel anything sharp, okay? We're just going to put some cords here around you, so you may feel a little bit of vibration from the cords, okay? Okay, you feel just a little bit of pressure here, okay? A tiny little skin nick. Exactly. Okay, we can open up. Okay, that looks good. You're just going to hear some beeps and buzzes now. You let me know if anything feels sharp. Can we go live, please? Thank you. That's it. Maria, it's going real well. You doing okay? Good. That's what I want to hear. No. So you can remove it now? Pretty much, you know, everything that I can okay. see. Yeah. That's what we're going to strive for. You still doing okay? Yes. I've got about 90% of it gone. Okay, don't hurt at all. Okay, good. We can put that audio on then, right? Yes, <laughs> you can put that on the audio. Okay. <laughs> Sample just a few more and we'll be done. Still okay, Marie? Yeah, still okay. Okay, we're finished. We're just going to put in that little marking clip and be done. And the marking clip will show up on the mammogram? Exactly, the yeah. It's about two millimeters, so that that way we know exactly where we've been in there, and we can follow it on your subsequent mammograms, okay? Okay. See me, may you? Thank you. And we're all done. Now, did I tell you that was going to be so much easier than the other one? So much easier. I told you. That's why I was afraid because it was so painful. Piece of cake. So our case today was a 45-year-old female that presented with a previously diagnosed fibroadenoma in her right breast at the 11 o'clock location. The reason she came today for, to see us is because she wanted the fibroadenoma removed because it was causing her pain. So as you can see from her mammogram, she has a nodule in the right breast at the 11 o'clock location. We performed an ultrasound today which shows the smoothly lobulated nodule with slight inc increase through transmission fitting with the diagnosis of a previous fibroadenoma. I decided today to proceed with an 8-gauge mammotome. It was very fast, very efficient. The patient had no bleeding today. She was very comfortable during the procedure. As you can see on our post-biopsy mammogram films, there is really no residual nodule left and there is a clip in place. There is a slight amount of bleeding after the biopsy, but none during the procedure itself. As you can see from our specimens that were taken after the biopsy, there are many samples which show part of the fibroadenoma and part of the fatty tissue. This is the portion where I was getting near the very end of removing the last little bits of the fibroadenoma. Many of the samples were completely contained with fibroadenoma. So the last image I'd like to show today is the one of the ultrasound image of the mammomark clip and the fact that there is no remaining fibroadenomatoid tissue surrounding the mammomark clip. So in conclusion, I think the 8-gauge mammotome is a very efficient, fast tool for fibroadenoma in a patient who desires complete removal.